Hi, I'm George, and I'll be showing you how to use Affinity Photo to fix JPEG artifacts like we have around these propeller blades in here and in the sky. Real messy stuff, easy to fix. Now, if you like this video, make sure you hit that like button, click on share, click on subscribe, check out my channel for more Affinity Photo videos, and take a look at my complete training course for Affinity Photo. And there's a link for that right down there in the description. Okay, now the way that we fix this is to use a special tool and it's right over here. It's with the blur, sharpen, and smudge tools. It's called the median brush tool right there. I'm just going to first back out so you can see this whole picture. There we go. Doesn't look too bad if you go back far enough, but you can still see the problems in there around the propeller blades, for instance. You can still see this stuff up in the sky. Now, most programs go through the whole image and try to remove all of that, but that tends to blur the image. It's better if you can be very selective about the parts that you want to fix and only fix the parts that are most obvious. So if we zoom back in again on the propeller blades up here, there we go. And let's just pull this down into position. Real nasty kind of stuff happening in here. And that's where this new medium brush tool really comes in handy. Okay, that's what we're going to be using. See, here's your brush size. You find your options up here at the top. There's the width. This is your brush size right here. Mine's set at 16 pixels. That's pretty good for this. There's an opacity setting. Flow, if you're a little unsure about this, you can bring your flow rate down a little bit so it doesn't go on quite as fast. Hardness this is the softness of the edge. 80 is pretty good on this one. So let's go ahead and just see how this works. All you have to do is just to brush right over an area like that and look at that. It just cleans that all out. And notice how it found where that edge was. I can paint right over the edge and I don't lose that edge. That's the beauty of this tool. Now, one of the things about your more normal tools for doing this kind of repair is that they're going to touch the whole image. For instance, if I drag this over this little bit right there, it blurs that out, so I don't want to have that touched. Let's just undo that. And this tool allows me to work around that detail, leave that detail in, and clean up everything else without touching that one bit of detail. So I have that ability here by being able to brush this in to be very precise as to where I want to have this repair happening. So even though it is a blur tool, and all of these JPEG artifact removal tools are blur tools, this one is a very controllable tool, and it does look for those edges, and it allows you to work right up against an edge without losing that nice hard edge. So there we go, there's the two blades and on the top of this airplane right there. So real, real nice tool. It's very easy to use, as you can see. Just come in and brush in the areas that you want to clean up. Now, I am working in very small in the image, and it will take me a long time to go through the whole image and repair this. But for a good photograph, this is worth the time to go ahead and do this. Now, some spots you may not want to use this on, other spots you may want to, may be okay. This also works up here in the sky. You can kind of see some stuff right up in here in the sky. Zoom to here, we'll just back out of touch. You can see now these two propeller blades right up in here. We fixed those and look how much better these look than the blades right down here, which are really messy. So beautiful tool, one of my personal favorite tools here inside of Affinity Photo. If you do a lot of work with JPEG images, I kind of consider this one tool as being worth the whole cost of the program. And this one tool is so great on giving a very valuable tool for retouching your images that it, it really is just about worth it just for that one tool. So there you go. That's how to use that medium brush tool right here to remove and repair JPEG artifacts in a photograph. And if you enjoyed this video, make sure you hit that like button. Click on share. Click on subscribe. Check out my channel for a bunch more Affinity Photo videos. And take a look at my training course for Affinity Photo. And the link for that is right down there in the description. Okay, and I'll see you next time.